Hey guys, how's it hanging? I'm Genevieve, your Sunday here on Basically Us. So for this week, if I'm not mistaken, I think we're doing our everyday makeup. Like, that's what I read. I could be wrong, but I'm I'm pretty sure this is what we're doing. Um, so yeah, pretty self-explanatory. We're just going to show you what we do. Everyday makeup. Our everyday makeup. And... Yeah, I guess let's get started. Okay, so I already like washed my face, like moisturized, and I use like the Cara Fay Cera V. I don't know how to pronounce it, no. but like it's really good because my skin's like combination, so like it's dry sometimes, like like you know oily sometimes. So yeah, my doctor recommended that, and like I love it. It like makes my skin so like moisturized and amazing. So yeah, I'll put a picture somewhere if I remember because um. I always forget to insert pictures, so yeah, I'll try my best. I'm just gonna, you know, put this hair up and out the way. By the way, if I'm looking right here, it's because I have my mirror right here. So, I apologize if that bothers you. Okay, so I just start off with my Makeup Forever Step 1 Skin Equalizer Mattifying Primer. Um, I wouldn't say I'm not a big fan of this, I just... I found other primers that I like a lot better. I just put that all over, I use my hands. My hands are clean, don't worry, I just wash them. And yeah, I let that sit in for a second. Um, you're probably wondering why I'm sitting outside, like always. Um, it's nice outside, the lighting is a lot better, and this is like my filming spot. I like filming out here because in my room, it's like the lighting is messed up. It's weird. It's is now no bueno, no bueno. This brush, where is it? Where are you? Okay, I use this, like, it doesn't say where it's from. I use, like, this foundation brush or whatever. And then I just paint it on my face. Okay, it might not look like my color, but, like, trust me, once it blends out, it does and stuff. Okay, now that I put that on and it looks so sloppy, I just blend it out with my beauty blender because it just makes it look so freaking nice. Also, I'm like so sorry if you hear the wind. I don't know why it's like so windy, like it's never this windy. Okay, now that that's all blended, I do my eyebrows first, cause then I like clean them up with concealer and then like, yeah, whatever. So for my eyebrows, I don't really do much. I just take like this little elf like brush, like this angled brush with a spoolie. I brush them out first. And then I take the Anastasia uh, brow powder duo in dark brown and then I just like mix the two so I mainly use the darker one because I don't know I like the darker look but yeah I don't really do much I just like outline them and then like fill in where I think I need you know filling in eyebrows are like the most important thing to me because I don't know I feel like that's what everybody notices first and like I can't have that eye I feel like they're a lot thicker than they usually are, only because I haven't gotten them threaded. So, like, they're everywhere right now. But, so far, so good. Okay, and then next, what I do is I use concealer. And I ran out of my LA Girl Pro Concealer, because that's, like, the one I usually use. Um, I use Classic Ivory. That's the one I use because I like, you know, highlighting underneath. But today, I'm going to use my... Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Concealer in Brightener because your girl likes to brighten. That I like that brightening look. So yeah, I put that on the my the bridge of my nose, my cupid's bow, my chin, under my eyes a lot, and on my forehead because that's where I like to highlight. And then I just blend it up with the beauty blender. If you didn't notice already. Alright, so next I'm just going to clean up my eyebrows with some concealer. And I'm going to use the Naked Skin, Urban Decay Naked Skin uh, Concealer in Medium to Light Neutral. So yeah, I just take a little bit on this um, Wet n Wild Small Concealer Brush. And you know, I go in. I gotta make sure these puppies look decent, you know? 
And then I just like blend that out with my beauty blender. And I'm done. And then there are my brows. And do the same to the other brow. This is gonna be like the shittiest like makeup routine video thing ever. I'm so sorry. I'm really feeling this eyebrow, so. I'm like a proud mom right now. I just, you know, pat this on. This brush sucks, by the way, so, like, as you see, like, there's a lot of, like, little hairs. But, like, I need to get a new brush. So, this will do for now. I use this, um, Real, Techni Real Techniques Multitask Brush. And then I take my Physician's Formula Butter Bronzer. It smells so good. It smells like Tropical Paradise. Um, this is in the shade Bronzer. Okay, you know, swirl it in there a lot. And then I tap that bad boy off. And then I just like, you know, go. So I just do it on the like hollows of my cheeks, on my like chin, chin, jawline. <laughs> so, you know, you gotta get that jawline, you know, bronze that shit up. And then on the forehead, you know, trying to give that bronze illusion because, you know, your girl hasn't gone tanning in a really long time. I take this brush and I just like, you know, I guess blend it out more. Now I'm gonna start on with the eyes, which I really don't do much. Well, I guess I kind of do a lot. I'm gonna be taking my Modern Renaissance palette. You know, this is the bomb, 10 10 recommend if you don't have it. Um, and I'm just gonna go in with Raw Sienna as like a transition shade. Um, like I said, I have no clue what I'm doing, so like this is all just me learning as I go. And I'm just gonna put that like in my crease and all over, you know, all that fun stuff. Wow, I'm such a beauty guru. Okay, so now I'm just gonna go in with like red ochre and venation, you know, mix them two bad boys together. And then I'm just gonna put that like in my like crease. Okay, so if you know me, um, you know, when in doubt, red it out. So literally the only ever, the only looks I ever do are red looks, so yeah. Now I'm just gonna take like antique bronze and put that in my like outer corner. No. Um, on this brush, I'm gonna take bon, bon Fresco, Bon Fresco. I don't know if like there's a specific way to say it. And I'm just gonna put that like on the inner, like on my lid, like on the inner, you know, half of my lid is that. Add real gar. You know, I'm not showing you the colors, I'm just saying them. So like real gar, you know. Lovely orangey like color. And then I'm just gonna put that everywhere. I love that color. The same this little brush, and then I'm gonna get Vermeer. Actually, should I get Vermeer? Yeah, I'll get Vermeer. Actually, I think I'm gonna get Primavera. Yeah, we're gonna go in with Primavera, you know, and put that in like on top of where we put the white, not the white, where we put Bon Fresco, which is. Okay, so now I'm gonna do that to the other eye and then I'll be back. All right, so next I take my, uh, what is this, curling? Eyelash curler. I take my eyelash curler and I curl my lashes. If you've never like tried this, like if you haven't like curled your lashes before, 10-10 recommend, like it makes such a difference. Um, I think my eye lashes are like not, not like, cause I know a lot of people that are like, oh my God, you can't even see my eyelashes. Like I think mine are like pretty good. Like I like my lashes. I'm gonna take the Better Than Sex Mascara. This is not waterproof, but like, I think I really want the waterproof one. And I put that on my top lashes. Oh my god, I just got that on my contact. How beautiful is that? So now what I'm gonna do is, before I coat my bottom lashes, I'm gonna, you know, take the Modern Renaissance palette again and take the same brush that comes with the palette and I'm just gonna put like Venetian Red and Real Bar under my, you know, and then um, I'm gonna take 
cream, I mean, not cream remover, rear mark, and put that like on the inner corners of the bottom and in my tear duct, you know, to highlight that inner corner. And then now I get to put mascara on the bottom lashes. Uh, I'm gonna move on to highlighter. I'm gonna use my Jeffree Star Skin Frost in Lavender Snow. This one has like a purple, like, you know, hint to it, so like, if you don't want the purple, then I don't suggest this one, but like, it's a really, really nice highlighter. So I'm just gonna take my e.l.f. tapered brush, and then I'm just gonna like, you know, run it through this, and then, you know, hit it off, and then I'm just gonna highlight. Your girl loves her highlights, so this is gonna be like, intense. Can you just, can we, can we? beautiful. I love it so much. Like, this is like such a beautiful highlight. Like you're lying to me if you say it's not. Like just highlight my cheeks, um, my the tip of my nose, the bridge of my nose. I use my finger for the bridge. I highlight the bridge of my nose. Um, and then my cute though. I love a strong highlight, and this is definitely a strong highlight. So like, if you're looking for a really, really intense highlight, I suggest checking out Jeffree Star's, like, you know, Skin Frost, because they're amazing. Like, can we just take a moment to, like, appreciate how beautiful that is? So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put blush. Um, I'm just gonna use my Milani Luminoso blush, you know. It's cute, it's cute or whatever. I'm just gonna swirl it in there and you know, tap it off because we don't want that much. These are so pigmented. And then I'm just gonna like go on like windshield wiper, like circular, small sort of circular motions, but like windshield wiper motions. And then I don't put too much because I don't want like intense like blush. And I think that's everything. Um, oh wait, just kidding, that's not everything. I forgot my lips. So I usually go for like a nude. So today I'm gonna go with, which is this one, Dolce K. This has actually been a favorite recently. All right, so that is it for my makeup. Um, there's a lot of things like I'm missing, like I don't have brow gel, I ran out, I don't have setting spray. Uh, it's usually what I go to, like if I wore to do my makeup, like I said, I don't wear makeup that much. But if I were to wear makeup, this is pretty much what I would do. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. What's your favorite makeup brand? That's what you should comment down below. Um, and yeah, subscribe to basically us. Subscribe to my channel, which is me, Genevieve and Kristen. Um, I might do like a makeup video soon. Maybe. I don't know. I probably won't because this one came out bad. Um, but yeah, if you want to see more of me or Kristen, then go subscribe. Link's down below. And follow all my social media and all that fun stuff because I want to be friends. Let's talk. Let's chat. Let's, let's have conversation. Um, but yeah, uh, I love you guys and bye.